Hey everybody, it's Brian Gardner. Welcome back. I am WordPress advocate at WP Engine and doing a series called Five Things I Love About WordPress. Now, this feature is life-changing, though not many people know about it and not many people use it. It's called List View. Let's get started. Okay, so as I mentioned, this is a feature that not everybody knows about, but it's really impactful for those who are building with WordPress. Uh, I'm in my dashboard. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to insert uh, the full page pattern uh, for the home page using the Frost theme uh, just so I can demonstrate this. I'm going to go ahead and update this. We'll right click and we'll see here. This is the home page. And so you can see there are various sections of the home page. And inside of the edit screen, there's this little button here called document overview, or in other words, we call it list view. And when you open that up, it sort of shows a folder structure on the left-hand side where you can use that to navigate uh, each section. So I'm gonna go in and you just click on an arbitrary block and you can see how this sort of expands. And so you can see here, uh, this top section, um, all the way down here past the image uh, is made up of a group of columns uh, inside of the column, you've got a heading, a paragraph, and then buttons, and you can see them highlighted uh, as I click through. And one thing that's newer to WordPress, and this is really helpful when you've got really long feature rich pages, is the ability to rename these. You can see here on the three little buttons, uh, I'm gonna click rename, and I'm just gonna call this hero section, just to keep it simple. And then uh, I'm going to click on the second group. You can see that those are my set of logos. And just to, to show this one more time, I'm going to rename this. We'll just call them site logos. And then as I uh, reduce this, you can start to see how uh, easy this is to build with. Uh, speaking of building, I'm going to go ahead and just rename this one build with frost. So I know where I am as I'm selecting each of these. Now, similarly, inside of the site editor, uh, the same thing holds true. You can click on this. I'm just going to leave the page. Uh, I'm going to go and just edit a page uh, template here. This is the general page template for Frost. Uh, I'm going to click here on the, um, the center. You can see the three little lines. And once again, you've got what's called list view. Uh, and so here you can see I've got the header down here, the footer. And then here in the middle is the group. Uh, maybe we want to rename this for some reason. We'll just call it content. And then inside of there, you can see there's the group that holds the content, uh, the another group that holds the title, and then this is the actual content block here. So list view just allows you to just do things uh, very easily. I'm gonna go back into the page that I created, the home page, to show one more feature uh, of list view. Uh, and I'm gonna click here, popping open list view. Uh, because I didn't save it, they just sort of defaulted back to the groups. Uh, what, what you can do with list view is let's just say you wanted to rearrange a few sections. These can be dragged and dropped very easily up and down the screen. Or if you're in list view and you have something highlighted, you can click the move up arrow uh, to move them back. And so again, and if you wanted to sort of multi-select and do take these two groups and group them together, you could just select them and then do group and then it puts them together in a group. This is list view, it's really easy but it's very awesome. And it reminds me a lot of Figma and sort of how designers are used to sort of uh, labeling each of the sections and naming them descriptively. So this view, very powerful, very uh, seldomly understood feature, but here it is. I hope you enjoyed this walkthrough and look for more in my series, Five Things I Love About WordPress. Have a great day.